we could do with putting together a posse to go and attack this outpost. I mean, Red Dwarf has a great record against Squid. <laughs> Red, Dwarf, so... Red Dwarf has, he like, actual now. working what? guns now. I'm uh -oh. going to the... Why is it not shooting? Oh, there, squid. Why is it not shooting? <laughs> why is it not shooting? Uh, should I build us a forward operating base, like, uh, rover? Suz, yes. I've always thought that a grinding rover is pretty cool. Okie dokie. Uh, it's probably going to... Oh, ooh, no. Oh, no. The, uh, oh, no. Oh, no. It's cow. still shining. <laughs> See, this is what happens if you set it to only shoot the weapons. It comes it's in on, on, on all of its zombie. thrusters. Does anyone want to join me on another quest to take out this outpost? Well, I mean, I may, I may as well take the Red Dwarf along with it, right? Uh, where are you, RTX? Sorry. Uh, you can see the panda. The big uh, black thing. Hang on, I'm looking for it, sorry. Where is it? Good good progress so far, guys. <laughs> uh, feeling the reassurance of your rescue operation. Oh, no. What is that? What is our no? Uh, 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 yeah, the dwarf is uh, somewhat upside down. Do you want me to port to you? Hang on, where, whereabouts <laughs> are you? Yeah, yes, I would need to port her, I think. I've also probably broken the guns, unfortunately, which makes it somewhat useless. You know, Marines always don't leave a man behind, or I think they'd probably just uh, <laughs> shoot you in the head and uh, be done with it. Oh, okay. Would you like to build some more landing gear for me? What? Oh, did you break your landing gear? Landing. Yep. Oh, uh, I don't know if I have the anything on me to build it with. Well, that's where you're landing. Where did your landing gear go? On the big sticky outy bits. Uh, I don't have any steel plates, so no, I cannot build any landing gear for you. I mean, it looks like your vehicle is a ready source of steel plates. <laughs> I mean, so is the Trinity Porter, to be fair. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, but the Trinity Porter is, is going to fly off in a minute, isn't it? I am. Um, I, I know Kevin Bacon was supposed to be a grinding machine, but I uh, am taking the opportunity to get rid of some of the bigger bits. Uh, uh, okay, well, I don't have motors uh -huh. or cool. construction comps oh, either. I've done so. a couple of bits as well. Ed, what are you building? Yeah. Oh, it's, I, I thought I thought I'd join the fun in terms of making gunnery machines. Okay, oh, what so are you you're building? building a large grid rover. <laughs> Is that not what RCX did for his gunnery machine? Uh, yeah, but RCX knew yeah, what he was I doing. I think RCX has a license for large grid. I think you only have a small grid license at the moment. <laughs> well, I'm afraid this is going to have to be unregistered and uninsured. <laughs> Also, it's on wheels. What can possibly go wrong? Uh, shut up. Indeed. Oh. Yeah, bollocks. This is not going so well. What are you doing, Rev? Ah. I'm, I'm just looking okay. whether I can pinch a motor out of your oh, suspension. Bollocks. Yeah, like, don't pinch a motor out of the suspension. Okay. I need the suspension to drive the car. That's not fine. much use if you flip the car over and then oh. I can't drive it. I will <laughs> go and drive the six kilometers to Panda and so then catch up with him. There's a fleeting rival uh, behind you, our sketch down. Uh, I am aware. Oh, do speak up if like one comes over there towards is one the base. In front of me as well. It, it's sort of vaguely going towards the base. There's another one. There are two fleeting rivals, and it's why am I not shooting it? <laughs> Very good question. Oh shit! So can we just just talk about the this gun thing again, right? Because it just flew close to me. And I didn't shoot it. Does that mean it had no no offensive systems or or what? Uh oh. Oh bollocks. Uh, uh oh. <laughs> Welcome back, RCX. <laughs> what did you die of? Um a fleeting rifle. Oh really? What? Oh. But not in your vehicle. A though. surfeit of fleeting rifles. Why didn't um, you spawn in the panda, though, RCX Chan? Uh, probably because the uh, panda was unable to respawn me. Really? It looks fine to me. It, oh, no, it, it is. Does, it, it, it is does not, not look very fine. fine. It does not look fine. It is on fire, and there's a hole <laughs> in the roof. Oh dear. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Aha, okay. I have a survival kit back. Ask the what are you up to? Uh, shooting a fleeting rifle. Give me a moment. Um, what I could do with, if anyone is likely to be heading in my direction. Yeah, I'm only. I was uh, uh, I'm, I'm planning to head in your direction. I'm uh, planning to head in your direction. Uh, like large, large ammo would be helpful. Uh, I don't better. I, I have hit everything except the engine on this thing. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, oh fuck. Uh, it won't unlock, it won't unlock. <laughs> oh god, I, I, my game's just lagged. Yeah. I can't see what you've just done, but I'm guessing it's not good. It's not that bad, it's not that bad. Yeah, it's not, uh, it's not actually town. that bad. It's yeah, bad. it doesn't look that bad. It's... You die again. Yeah. yeah. I'm just like... Why did it not unlock? Oh, this is better. Oh, Why don't no, I do this all the time? I forgot the thing about the two landing gears. I was just, I was merely switching from one locked, the other unlocked, to the one oh. unlocked, the other locked the whole time. Yeah, Great. if I ever have multiple landing gears, I always just put them on as separate things on the hotbar. Uh, well, I'm making some progress with uh, welding our new floor. It would be nice to like be able to build in a bit so that we can actually get some refineries and stuff underground. Sure. There we go. Okay. How's that? There we go. Perfect. Uh, it's upside down still, Rev. I did. Oh, really? That's exactly yes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I thought I thought this was a perfect position to release it, and it will be the right way up. But... Exactly the exactly Sorry. the same position it started in. Only more that, damage. That is actually quite funny. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, uh, it's, rain, it's raining uh, a bit, so, uh... I heard a bang. Oh. Oh, yeah, I think that was probably the thing we just shot down. Oh. Red Dwarf is, like, flying? Uh, yes, Red Dwarf is being carried by um, being Trinity Porter. Oh, but the Trinity Porter doesn't appear to have a beacon. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, it does. Can you not see it on top? Nope. SBC Trinity nope. Porter? Nope, only Red Dwarf. I can now move a tiny bit away from the thing before the dampeners move it back. Are you, are you going to attempt to uh, hmm. get it further, or should I, I just... I don't think it's the dampeners. Further. I no, think no, you're I still magneted to the connector. Back. Should we say again, then? I didn't catch that. I don't think it is the dampeners. I think you're still magneted to the connector. That's curious, because I have switched, as you can see from the colour, it is not set to lock. Oh, oops. Right, but... Oh, that's fine. Even when it's unlocked, when it goes yellow, it puts a force on it to, like, help you align it. Ah, so what I need to do is I need to get the connector and add an on-off. So no, no, I just add... lock it and unlock it again. There's, like, a grace period when you unlock where it doesn't magnet to let you fly away. Okay. So just lock now... it and unlock it again. And then it will go blue, and while it's blue, Wait, it's no, not magnetizing. Why am I trying to flip it that way? That's not the way I want to flip it. What am I doing? That's what I did just now. <laughs> <laughs> I just... Why am I not hitting this? What's the maximum range on the elite rifle again? Are you trying to take out the base, RTX, or have you not even got to the base yet? I am trying to take out the base. Yeah, I am on foot, so it is not like going very well at the Oh no! Oh, that's right. <laughs> See this little bit at the front here that sticks out the farthest needs right click drilling. This bit here? Well, below where you are. Uh, are you, you digging a foxhole there? Yeah. I tell you, I have the best foxhole digging equipment. He, he actually bit. does. I was incredibly impressed when I saw him just go straight down and create. <laughs> 
I was less impressed later on my on my flight back there when I went, oh, why am I on fire? And then, oh, why is that container blowing up? And then, yeah, I realized that someone was shooting me. But anyway. <sighs> why could it am be I that I am not too heavy? Anything? It could be that you're too heavy. Have you worked out what your maximum load is yet? Well, I think I just have. Okay, how much is it then? Somewhere around... Well, what's in the car? What's in my cargo bay at the moment? Let me just check. No, you, you, it shows you your total weight. Oh, oh if you mean total rate. weight, then yeah. my total weight is is what 112, mega, uh, 112 tons. Wow. How many up thrusters do you have? Only two, so I might have a couple more when I get back to base. And this one. Uh, yeah, two is like Not many. gonna get you to maybe ninety thousand comfortably, and anything over a hundred thousand is. Uh, going to be hard work. There's so much debris scattered around our base entrance now. Yep. If only we had like loads of people doing nothing who could build grinding ships. I'm, I am rescuing, I mean digging ships. I'm rescuing my digging ship. Oh, no, I mean that? a grinding oh, no. ship to get rid of all this debris. Oh, I see. Hmm. Why does my landing gear not engage? Aha, okay. Uh, because it's not touching anything. You're not actually standing on it, you're hovering. Oh, you've got the landing gear on a piston. Yeah, so that it could extend uh, <laughs> when I build my drills. Oh, the reason it's not, like, attaching is because you're not near anything. Like, it can't attach to the projection. Oh, I've... I've thrown down and I... Obviously, if I had the power to move it, I would. So, I'll you be back in just a moment. You move you, don't you? Indeed. I'll be back in a moment with some equipment to add some extra thrusters to my ship. Right, but the direction you need to go to lock the landing gear is down? So, right now, I'm less interested in locking... I see where I need to go, but... Um, I also need to not crash into things. So okay, what but I'm you're burning draw, power while you're doing this. I got 20 minutes. <laughs> it's not going to be 20 minutes when you've got that extra thruster on there. I'm going to be fine, he says boldly. <laughs> he says stupidly. <laughs> boldly, but probably it's incorrect. It's fine. fine. Oh, crap. I just somehow use this term capax myself. <laughs> um... By carefully landing and then on landing, I we I just bounced across half the map. That was quite funny. Hmm. I have destroyed the outpost, by the way. Oh, oh, oh thanks, thanks defense doing. officer. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, uh, it took longer than I would have hoped it would, but uh, I still need to fix up the panda because it's uh, not in a great shape at the moment. Like, the problem is, is yeah, it's only because he built a different rover. To do it, yeah. Like and and yet. not a missile <laughs> carrier that he doesn't yes. know how to make. Well, yeah, but I don't know how to make it. I wouldn't have known how to make the rover he made either, frankly. I mean, it's well, just the speed he's making it at. Yeah. Oh. Hey. What? Hmm. What are you going? A four. The oh, I said display. I need some displays. Oh, I definitely oh, heard a like the fonts. Yeah. Well, it's because he mumbles and it means that the auto voice detection thing doesn't cut in until like he's <laughs> fit already finished saying what he was going to say. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I feel like I should build more welders on this welding ship or a welding rover. I, you seem to have parked a rover in the parking space for the, um, the bumblebee, Mr. Heaney. Bear with me a moment. Could, could you could you move it? Um, as yet, probably not. Two seconds. But what, why have you put it in my parking space? Uh, it seemed like a good idea at the time. Yeah. Can we take it apart, since you're not going to build it anyway? Uh, I am going to build it. Are you okay? Um, I, in fact, I... As soon uh, as I have... Uh, hang on. Right, now I'm coming to build it. I was quite hoping to uh, connect up this vehicle to empty out all the nickel. 
Well, we don't need Nika now because we're just going to deconstruct uh, the office gargoyle. Yeah, you could, that is now for completely deconstructible. Wow, this is some science. What? And all this science? That I don't understand. In this case, I don't understand it. Do you notice something interesting about the rover I've just built? <laughs> is it that it's in my parking space? Yeah, why have you built a, a ramp to my connector? Oh, that was when I didn't have any hydrogen. It was the oh, only really? way I could get <laughs> ice out of the Duke Duke. What do you notice, Rev, about the rover that I'm in? Uh, that it's in my parking space. What do you notice about its attempt to move out? out? Oh, it's in midair. It is! How unusual. It's not I a station, see. is it? So it's not actually a rover, it's a rover that... It's a flying rover, I see. <laughs> Why don't you Trinity Porter it? I don't so want to Trinity Porter it, given the last experience of Trinity Portering. Wee. Oh, oh, no, as in just literally connect to it once and then disconnect and see if it falls to the ground. Why is this welder not working? Uh, is it because you weld yourself at night? Ah, uh, can you not weld that? Can you not weld that block there, maybe? Or is that... Ah, no, I know why. That's because there's a thing in the way. May I get in your cockpit, Heaney? Woof. Certainly, certainly. Yeah. Success! Thank you, Dan. <laughs> oh, Success. You might want to put handbrake on. Handbrake on. Do you know where I am? Dead. Oh, but wait! I put Bertha's thingy on this thing so I can re so I can just um. No. So, oh, do I need to do something to switch the wheels on? Or? Do you need to turn the handbrake off? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Success. Everybody's liking these five by five large grids wheels, aren't they? They are, they are the thing. They are the wheel. They just make your ship quite unwieldy. Or too <laughs> wieldy. No, 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 or wieldy in your case. Uh, I, I assume it's us who's been patching up all of these holes in the ground with little patches. Some of them, yes. Or, <laughs> yeah. If, if, they're, if they're camo, then yes. I'm sorry if I've done something wrong. Yeah, that's fine. Put some, have you put camo on the jaw sergeant yet, Mr. Heaney? I mean, the reason I, I guessed so. it was you is that it's helpful. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've, been, I've been mining, you know. It's, uh, it's, uh... I did actually do I did, I did actually do a little bit of mining for Dan. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Or mining for iron, in fact. Indeed, I didn't find any Dan or. Any Dan or what? Any Dan or RCX. Okay, can I make this? Oh no, no, I've died and the bumblebee's flying! Oh my god! Can you see oh where the bumblebee's flying? Yes. Is it flying somewhere bad? Oh, it oh, oh yes, it, it is quite bad. It is quite bad. Oh How no, bad? it's it's stopped. Where, where it's fallen it? over. Where is it? Where is it? It's like oh. in front of our tunnel entrance. Would you like me to write uh, it? That's that's fine. That's not that bad. That could have been all. a lot worse. Yes, that could um, have been a lot worse. It doesn't really have any sideways thrust, does it? Uh, no, because like the, everything got shot off that. by the uh, the funny uh, dudes. Well, you, you might have Google. trouble writing it then. No, that's fine. I can just go build new ones. Oh, yeah. yeah, it doesn't have any thrusters on the side that you would like it to have thrusters. Uh, that's okay. It's okay. Just so long as I didn't destroy everyone else's vehicle with my out of control. I like how you have them. three large sideways thrusters going like the wrong way. Yeah, I've just writed it from the other side. Uh -huh. Well, you might have to grind those down and put them back on the other side. Sure, that's what we're doing. Oh, shooting. Fleeting rifle. Fleeting rifle. Bang, bang. Oh, it's kind of showering bits all over the big grey thing. Oh no, I'm losing reputation with the search for grinding down the drone that they sent to kill us. It's the kind of reputation I'm not afraid of losing. So, so how's the rebirth of Kevin Bacon going? Uh, it went slowly. Wait, what's on fire now? 
Everything is on fire. I got it's hit by it. some drone. I've got a busted thruster. <laughs> is that what they're Try saying days? that three times fast. Busted thruster, busted thruster, busted thruster. That was slow. Bust your buster. Busted thruster, busted thruster, busted thruster. Busted thruster, busted thruster, busted thruster. Okay, welding time. Stop. Welding time. Oh, oh, no, stop, 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 stop. Ah, okay. Oh, I wish I could do time lapses like Splitzy. Why can you not? Oh, because the way of doing them is you set up like an extra computer as a client in the game. And you're not hardcore enough for that. I don't have spare computers lying around. At least not the kind that can run Space Engineers. Like, obviously, I do have spare computers lying around because, you, you know, you can't not yeah, have computers you would, wouldn't yeah. these days. But, you know, they're arm powered computers, not I mean, mighty graphics beer moths. We didn't find out what um, Doug Chan's uh, green drill was called, did we? Uh, I called it the mall, but it's like... Oh, no, that, that like, is a bit of a... Sh it's a shit. It's too cliched, isn't it? It's yeah. Like, I mean, we could build a Thunderbird 2 with uh, changeable pods. No, I, I saw one on YouTube. It looked a bit shit. Well, that's why you can make it better. Well, that's because it was all made of puppets. Oh, you meant not the real Thunderbirds 2, right? Yeah. Whoop. Sorry. <laughs> what was that? Uh, don't worry, it wasn't anything important. <laughs> oh dear. Been a bad. Bumblebee was going so well until it got shot by a bunch of dudes. Oh, you ass! You, or wh whoever's. <laughs> do you do you see what happened? I see that you Sorry. have managed to take off. Um, actually, you've only taken off the cargo. Container. It's just a cargo container, but also, why is your cargo container full of rocks? It, should, it should be full been... of iron. I mean, it's well, a mining it was... ship. When it should have been drained. So you've got a. It should be drained. No, but Mr. Heaney, it can't get out your cargo container. It shouldn't get into the cargo container. Look at the sorter. No, but but, but no, yes, you got it. This cargo container had a sorter going into it, and no way for the mined materials to escape. Yeah, the, 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 look, there are ejectors here. No, but There's other sorters. I, I, I don't. Surely the purpose of your mining vehicle was to obtain materials. Yes. To bring back to base. Yes. No. Yes. So Hold one... on, I'm just repairing my ship from where you bust it. <laughs> Good retort. <laughs> well, not not really. <laughs> but, but, so so surely one is wanting to. Uh... Rev, I assure you, there aren't any rocks in the cargo containers. They're only there um, because they have all, they should all have been kicked out. Yeah, yes. Yeah, so look on the floor. There's a, there's a. Oh, maybe that's my nickel that I've just dropped on the yes, floor. Yes, yes, that okay. would be yours, Rev. Yes. I was mining iron. So I just go and get some interior plates and rebuild my ship where you destroyed it. Sure. I love the little hoo noise you get. Okay. You do what? When you dock. It's. It stopped again. Okay. Uh, where is the cockpit on this vehicle? Oh, there. Get out. Go. Oh. Well, I couldn't move it, but I think that's because of the thrusters rather than no, because give, of... Just give it a tap on A. Give it a quick tap on I A. I did give please. it a tap on A. Nothing happens. Uh, but, well, surely the thrusters should all turn on is what should happen. You just pop in. Just give it a quick tap on A. I mean, it's using 100% power. Okay. Oh, there you go. Out. Yeah, it's, it's your power. You're just like... Uh, I accidentally have an extra oxygen bottle. You're just draining all of the power. Let's chuck a battery on, shall we? <laughs> this is why uh, Mr. Heaney and I wanted to uh, park up when we got back, but never mind. You wanted to park up where? No, no, it's not the energy, it's the power. There is enough energy in the batteries, but they cannot supply enough power. Oh, yeah, no, they didn't get shot off, did they? No, I was expecting them to have got shot. That's just excuse after excuse with you, isn't it? 
<laughs> At first it was what I wanted to put an extra battery on. Oh no, I wanted to charge the batteries for longer, and that wouldn't have made a difference. And then you're like, oh, well, I thought the batteries the whole, would get shot so off. The whole point is that the batteries are a reservoir of power. The, the power for the engines comes from the batteries. So if I connected the connector, it would uh, charge me up. I, I've got zero right, charge you, in the batteries. The, the amount the of point. power the batteries can supply would still be the same. No, but the, the batteries have no charge. That's the problem. But, well, they can't be completely empty because your lights are still on. Yeah, they are, they are limited to what the reactors are producing. So the stored uh, power. Is you've got reactors as well. Why have you got reactors? Well, for exactly this situation. Calm but apparently, terrible. it doesn't work in this situation. No, it doesn't work in this situation, does it? But, so why uh, have anyway. you got reactors? Well, I, well, because I thought it would work in this situation. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, I'm sitting inside the Duke Duke, and there's just like bumblebees and waters whizzing around outside the window. Sure. Shoo, shoo, shoo. I'm trying to sort them away. <laughs> Buzz off. off game. Well, I'm trying to avoid the wind turbines as well, don't forget. You are trying to, like, pick up the end of the engine there. It's not a good place to lift it. Try the side of one of those sideways mounted ones. Yep. You're locked. Oh. Yeah, but I, I really wanted to be a bit more straight than that. You are going <laughs> to toast the bumblebee yeah, there. I, oh, I, I've been toasting the bumblebee the whole day. Like, that sounds yeah, like yeah, yeah. one of those like uh, Kaylee dances, you know, like strip the willow, toast the bumblebee. Wow, do you know what's surprisingly easy to build even on a large grid? The answer is everything that isn't a large atmospheric thruster. <laughs> uh, try building refineries and see if you still believe that. One step at a time, Dan. Well, I mean, I, I think that the a good next step for our interior base would be to uh, put some refineries and cargo in here. Do you know we've got a big pile of refineries uh, outside already? Yes, but they get shut up there. They look fine to me. Like, not an hour ago you were complaining about your abl ab ab ablative armour of yield modules getting shut up by drones. Sure. Well, they won't get shut up when they're in the mountain. There's a dust storm here, and I don't know where my car is. Ah, uh, but what about your towel? I know where my towel is. I also have a toweling dressing gown, which I, which I have here. Uh, does yet. your car have a beacon? It will do, but it doesn't yet. Mm. Dust storms are here to remind you to put beacons on your shit. Yeah, see, um, the drill sergeant does have a beacon. You'd think the drill sergeant wouldn't need one. He could just shout louder. Wait for it, wait for it. Hot! A lot more inspiring than Arthur Scargill. Yeah, well, what happened to Arthur Scargill? He just died in a big wreck. And also in game. And then got bits ground off him. <laughs> Indeed. Because he was hogging all the nickel. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> and also in game. Oh. Okay, this uh, welding is going a lot faster now that I've actually turned up the number of interior plates the Duke Duke is making. Oh. No, I say, just as I say that, I run out of interior plates. Oh. There is another... Oh yeah, there's an assert interception drones engaging. There's a scorpion coming at us at the moment. I don't care, I'm in the cave. some bits of drone raining down okay so the um, the base cave is ready for more drilling 
Lovely. Ha more horizontal drilling, though, presumably. Yeah, horizontal drilling. What the kids are calling it these days. Which I, which I am, I am into. You're well. into horizontal hey, drilling, are you? I like how I, you know, I thought at the start that we were going to be specialised into uh, like right-click drilling and left-click drilling, but in fact, we specialised into horizontal drilling and vertical <laughs> drilling. <laughs> more shots. Ah, uh, looks a bit dead. And making missiles that don't work. Oh. Also, why did you build the your drilling guide in green? Uh, I just, I didn't like think too much about what color it was. Yeah, that that much is clear. Oh, that's why I can't lower that anymore. It's because of the landing gear. Um. Yeah. Like, let's bring that up a bit. So, RCX has single-pandedly taken down the Assert Outpost. There'll be a respite from the drone attacks for a while, but will the troop use the time RCX has bought them to secure themselves, or will they just argue some more? Join us next time to find out. I've been welding up your stupid green steel plates for nothing. Why? Because they're in the way. I mean, like... They were meant mainly as like a framework to build the grid off of, as opposed to like the final, you know. Yeah, thing. but like, I can't tell my welder that, can I? It just sees an unwelded block, and it's like, yep. Well, 